Babe, I have a question. Okay. Oh, video question. <laughs> Would you rather kiss me for $1,000 or kiss the most beautiful woman in the world for $1 billion? Beautiful woman in the world. It could be a person, honestly, animal. I mean, for a billion dollars, I would find a way to kiss my own ass. You're okay? A billion with a B? You're so a billion? You're so a billion dollars? You're if so you <laughs> chose to kiss me for a thousand dollars, I would divorce you out of principle. You're supposed a billion to dollars say. with a B? That is life changing. That is generational changing. No, life. listen to me. You're supposed to say, but babe, you are the most beautiful girl in the world. Shit. And I. <laughs> yeah. That was probably the right answer as a married man. Cody, I have another question. Oh, God. <laughs> so, I die tomorrow. Uh, tragic. Li dead. You grieve for an appropriate amount of time. You yeah. get remarried. When you die, who are you getting buried next to? My third wife. I believe the first time I'm married is definitely for love, but the second time I'll marry would definitely be for money. She's gonna die long before. The third time is definitely because I'm gonna be addicted to those little blue pills. She'll have a good 50 or 60 years before she dies, and she can uh, she can be the one I'm buried next to. You know, I think it's only right. Most recent wife. I am the mother of your children. Yeah, well, the first set of children. I'm sure this younger wife, third wife, I'll probably end up with like 10, 12 kids. You better hope your freaking penis still works by the Cody, I have another question for you. I have another trick question. No, it's not a trick. Okay. Would you love me, still love me, if I were a worm? Okay, I know what you want me to say, which is, of course, I love you forever, but the answer That's is the definitely, answer. the answer is definitely no, okay? Because you would leave me in a horrible spot, all right? Because here's the thing, if you turned into a worm right now, 0% of the population believes that you just magically turned into a worm. They're all going to want to know where the body is, and no, <coughs> you've been nowhere. Last place you were seen was with me. I'm the murder suspect, so and I maybe they have no evidence to convict me of any crime, but the court of public opinion will go down that I murdered you. Some jealous something, or they'll come up with a story. So I turn into and a worm, and you're the, the worm. victim. This is my only defense. Is like, look here, this worm is my wife. Yeah, no, that is, unless, did you choose this? Because it seems a little selfish. I would love you if you were a worm. Oh, do you have another question? <laughs> another setup? No. Yes. You know the difference between no, I have a wife, and sorry, I have a wife. Six or ten. What? Whether she's a six or a ten. You <laughs> the audacity of this man. Cody, I have a question. Okay, I always answer these wrong anyways. You wake up tomorrow, I've been kidnapped. I am gone for 10 years. I escape, come back, find you. You are remarried. What do you do? You don't know me very well. There's no chance I'm passing up my taken opportunity, okay? I've developed a very special set of skills from going to the range two days a week and watching entirely too many action movies. This is my chance to be in Liam Neeson, okay? There's no chance in hell I'm passing that up. And I'm not really even driven by like love to find you. It's just, I really want to be like an action hero in real life. So. Need I remind you, an action hero, that you once fell off of a scooter and broke your kneecap. Were you the one who got kidnapped? So <laughs> this is all hypothetical. I can be an action hero in my hypotheticals. Okay. Cody, I have a question. Well, I have actually multiple questions this time. More there's this trend. There's this trend going around where women are asking their significant others these questions about them, and I need you to answer them rapid fire. Are you ready? I think I've seen this. Okay. <laughs> if I were a color, what color would I be? You are literally white. Oh my god. Caucasian. Caucasian. What about a flower? One that grows in the ground. Wild flowers. <laughs> I don't know. Okay. A dessert. 
um, everything but the ice cream. You literally are and most then, of the time a percentage of that ice cream. I love that ice cream. It is my favorite. That is fair. Uh, a season. Like salt? <laughs> are you... <laughs> First of all, why do I have to be the most basic seasoning of them all? Second of all, no. Like, time of the year. Like, summer, spring, fall, winter season. Oh. What is that? <laughs> what season am I? I don't know. You were born in the winter, so let's say winter. Okay. Time of day. T- time of... If you were a time of day... If I was a time of day. one thirty-seven p.m. <laughs> okay. I don't know. I don't even if know. If I were an animal... Uh, definitely a naked mole rat. <laughs> Very similar to the one from Kim Possible. Rufus. Rufus, yeah, that was his name. Okay. <laughs> what if I was a place? A place? A place. Walmart. Because <laughs> your legs are open 24-7. <laughs> that was a joke from high school. Oh my god. Fine, a gemstone. It's like a rock? If you were a rock? Like a shiny like rock. gravel? Like a shiny... What is a gemstone? Are there answers to this? Is there names of gemstones? I can't breathe. Like a shiny rock. So like a diamond? Like a diamond, yeah. Like other gemstones, like diamonds. So wait, is a diamond a gemstone? Oh. You're like fool's gold. <laughs> Cody, I have a question literally working it just participate okay so there's this filter that shows all of the cartoon boyfriends i'm gonna put the filter on you and you're gonna tell me whether or not you think you can take them in a fight yes i can D- just let me put the filter on you okay <laughs> <laughs> yeah i'm gonna whoop buzz's ass he thinks he has all these <laughs> weapons but no you're a toy you get in these hands okay. for sure Oh. Yeah, you know what? I'm going to be honest with you. <laughs> I'm still going to beat him up. He's too nice. He's going to let me get way too many cheap shots in and then it's over. You know what I mean? Over. A wreck. <laughs> you look I'm like a wreck. wreck Ralph. <laughs> who else we got? I don't even know how that is. He's from Big Hero 6. Oh, for sure going to beat him up. He had to, get, he had to have weapons to win. I'm going to take these guys down hand to hand. Easy. <laughs> Nobody said that they're fighting fair, though. And then I get my gun, and I still win. <laughs> All right, what do we got here? A la- you know what? He's scrappy. You know, if we're in a closed room, I'm throwing that little guy around. But I may never be able to catch him, so <laughs> it's also a problem. Oh, my God. I don't know who that is. Treasure Planet. He looks like kind of like a sissy, so yeah, no. for sure. Oh he's my, a, he's, st- we're do- it looks like I would be a sixteen-year-old getting what? That he is. Him, he's so. like he's a kid, well, so that you know. that checks out. We're doing one more. I don't know that is. That's either. John Smith from Pocahontas. Let's do. One. I will whoop his racist ass. <laughs> no. <laughs> you don't say anything negative about my boy Kristoff. You didn't do nothing. He is a pansy. <laughs> He gonna love me to death. Matter of fact, he might fall in love with me. You know what I'm saying? He likes it. Cody, I have a question. <laughs> like this, the laugh that accompanies listen, this question. Listen, listen, listen. Would you rather fight a chicken every single time you step foot in your car, or would you rather fight a lion once per year? Yeah, I've, I've, I've thought about this question for a while now. Actually, I've seen what? this video. No, okay. No. Correct answer: fight a chicken. You don't die. But it's not my answer, okay? Here's my thing. Every day, three, four times a day fighting that chicken, that's going to run my mental health down, okay? (laughs) And I know that I'll probably die fighting a lion, but I know that there's a chance that maybe I do it. Maybe I get good at fighting lions. I train. (laughs) I learn tactics. I can take a lion down once a year. There's risk, but I've got some chance. What I'm worried about is if I have to fight a chicken every day, all day, I mean, every time I get in my car, I'm going to go into a Taco Bell to get my order. I'm going to walk outside, see that chicken sitting in my car waiting on me, and it's me and everybody in Taco Bell going down, okay? I'm on a rampage now. It's, it's a problem. My <laughs> mental state would just de- deteriorate because little things, that's what pisses me off. I'm done. You know? Done. Cody, I have a question. Okay. <laughs> we go out to the bar. 
some guy starts flirting with me, all right, trying to buy me drinks. Okay. What do you do? What do I do or what do I wish I did? Because I, there are two different answers. What actually happens and what I wish happened is different. So here's what I want to happen. I want us to get a choreographed hand gestures that I can... You'll know that I want a double crown and coke, okay? <laughs> and that way, you can keep him going. Pull him in. I want you to be, you know, talk about this guy's life. Find out what he's doing, okay? You know, I'm perfectly fine with you going as far as like a light arm punch, you know? <laughs> keep this guy involved. And the whole time you're ordering crown and coke doubles, and you're drinking a lot. He's thinking, Ew. man, he's going to get lucky. And you're pointing over in that direction. Like, oh, my God, did you see what? something? Slide it over to me. I'm just sitting next to you back turn. He doesn't even know I'm there. I'm just down in free doubles. What about what about me? What do I get? Okay, you can have a drink too. You know what I mean? He can survive both of us. I'm perfectly fine with this. But here's my thing. What actually happens is immediately a man walks up to you and you're like, I'm married. Thank you for your kindness. But I have a husband who's going to spend $100 on drinks for me tonight. <laughs> I don't want to spend all that money on drinks. I'd much rather you get them for free. You're still going home with me. I guarantee it. Our marriage is rock I don't solid. know how I turn into the bad guy. Because you're not turn. financially responsible, okay? <laughs> and where we are in our relationship, <laughs> save a little money, baby. Okay? okay? Cody, I have a question. Do you just wait for me to sit in this chair? Yes. What is one thing that you despise about me? I got to narrow it to one. Literally, don't start with me. One, um, one thing. Yes. I would say that the three major things I want my kids to do, you do yourself do not do. What? So, like, my big thing is, like, I want my kids to keep their room clean. I want them to finish all their food. And I <laughs> hate being wasteful. And I'm going to be straight with you. You've never, ever kept your room clean. Not from when I met you That's to the day in our marriage. Not one time. That's not true. You you're, you you waste so many drinks, and it's just a, you know a five dollar Red Bull that's three quarters They're of the way. They're not five dollars. Either way, and then the meals. Oh my gosh, you'll go out to eat with me. You'll order two appetizers, a full meal, and a dessert, and I'm, you'll eat one bite of each, I'm and then be like, oh, I'm someone so else at home will eat it, and then we waste that you know forty dollars worth of food, and I have to sit there to my kids and be like, hey, I want you to clean your room, knowing I can't walk in mine, or finish all your food when you're sitting at the table having <laughs> eaten two bites and are you know never gonna eat anymore and then the wastefulness of your drinks the, it's like what do i tell them like don't waste I it's it's you, cut me off at the knees a little bit okay cut me off at the knees i'm done cody i have a question okay <laughs> would you rather take one inch from your height and add it to your penis or one inch from your penis and add it to your height. I'm definitely getting taller. Okay. What's that look for? <laughs> it's, it's nothing. What are you trying to say? It's I feel like I've done what I need to do with that thing. It's I got three kids now. What are you trying to say? It's nothing. You trying to say I ain't got an inch to lose? Cody, I have a question. Okay. <laughs> if my coochie <laughs> were a car what kind of car would it be <laughs> all right what is the most driven car in the world you rat bastard Toyota Corolla. no i hate you i hate you all right fine for real What's the most expensive car in the world? Oh my god! <laughs>